So Dr. Duvet did a nice lecture on horizontal projectile motion. So if you launch a ball or a bullet horizontally with speed V naught, and it's a height H above a surface, it will travel a distance L before it hits that surface. So we have set up an experiment here to do that. But in order to figure out how far the projectile will go, we need to know the initial velocity and the height above the surface. So what we have here is a spring gun and it has a trigger that you can pull. It has a bullet. I'll show you what it looks like. It's a little brass sphere. It gets mounted on the end. And then this black device that you see is a speed sensor. So as the bullet goes past the speed sensor, we can tell what its speed is. And we'll fire the bullet to measure its speed in a minute. And then I have a meter stick above the table, which is telling us that the, the brass ball is 86 centimeters above that surface at this time. Well, Mark, here we have this nice formula, and we're going to measure the velocity of the ball as it leaves the gun. Uh, we know the height above the table, so how are we going to tell that the ball travels the right distance as predicted by the formula? Well, you know, this seems like a pretty cool demo, and we could make it even cooler if we blew something up. What? Yeah. Well, this is a heavy little brass ball. I feel like that could blow something up. Well, what do you have in mind? Well, let's see what we've got. Well, look at that. I have a light bulb here. Wouldn't that be cool? That would be pretty good. Uh, that's not at the surface of the table. So the ball is going to be slightly above the surface of the table when it hits that ball. We need to measure the height of the ball. And to hit it nicely, I'd say about 8 centimeters above the table. So we'll have to subtract that from the height that the brass ball is above the table. And the difference in height will be uh, 86 centimeters minus 8, which is 70, uh, 78 centimeters. Well, that's going to be fun. Should be pretty good. Okay, so now we need to measure the speed. We measured the speed to be 5.42 meters per second. And the height of the light bulb above the table might subtract it from the height of the, the ball above the table. The height that we need is 0.78 meters. So we can calculate L. If you put all these numbers into the formula and use your calculator, get L equals 2.16 meters. So we need to place our target 2.16 meters away from the, the gun. Okay, Mark, so it looks like we know how far, 2.16 meters. So do you want to move the target to position? You bet. Let's do it. You have to maybe go a little bit closer to the ruler. 2.16? Yeah. Looks about right. Okay. You, you want to blow this thing up? Sure. You ready? I'm ready. Here we go. 